a drop cap can be used to give a great decorative element to your document. It appears as the first letter of a sentence that is larger than the rest of the text. A drop cap is most commonly seen in books, but it has a place in certain sorts of documents as well, and here's how to do so. First, sign in to your Google Docs, then open an existing document or create a new one. In this case, we will use this dummy essay for demonstrating. Place your cursor at the start of the word in the paragraph where you want your drop cap to appear. You can either remove the first letter of the word before or after creating the drop cap. Then, from the Insert menu, select Drawing and then click New. When a drawing window appears, click the Actions button in the top left corner and then choose Word Art. Enter the letter you want to use as the drop cap and press the Return or Enter key. Once your letter has appeared in the drawing window, you can edit it using the toolbar at the top. Choose a font style, make the letter bold or italic. You may also select the border and fill color from the font drop down box. By dragging the corner handles, you can resize the letter. And when you're finished, click Save and Close at the top to save the letter to your document. Select the letter by clicking it, and select Wrap Text from the option below the letter, and move the letter where you want it to be. You have now added a drop cap to Google Docs. If you found this video helpful, kindly like and subscribe. You may also click and turn on the notification bell so you can be notified from whenever we release new videos.